We started with a, a poetry anthology, collection of my poems. We started with a small booklet, Nyana, and then uh, three years later, down the line, a poetry album titled Maru. The album was on Spotify. The album did so great for us. It got us on platforms that we didn't ever think would be on. Yeah. So there's that. Also, I really want to encourage a lot of poets out there that, yeah, especially this industry around, like it's too a bit dry, man. Yeah. So we are trying to build up. But now we can't build up when there's no content. You know what I mean? Especially, especially monetized content. content, but of your So that's what we're trying to figure out for Rona, especially as poets. And we are, I don't wanna lie, we are most of us are inspired by 1994. 1994, there was no hip-hop on radio at all. Mm-hmm. There was mm-hmm. no hip-hop mm-hmm. on SABC, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But niggas were grinding. Yeah, yeah. Grinding. They kept grinding. Look at them now. Yeah. Out singing TV and that man. Kawi. Kawi. Five, ten minutes ago, it was like a rap song. Yeah. So Loro, now full of it. Like we are holding on to that. Or ah, it was soca any time from now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. After that, after that. Yeah. Yeah. So majita wants to do video. Majita wants to publish the book. Majita wants to do album. Majita wants to do video. Right, soca. Ah, soca ready. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean.